Hi everyone, in this video we will validate the email in JavaScript, how to write validation for the email. Uh, so now let's get started. I have already created this design, now we will validate it in JavaScript, okay. Uh, this is the form, first I will assign a name to my form, name is equal to F1. And also whenever we submit this submit button, so we should uh, call a JavaScript function. On submit, we should call a validation function. We will create the validation function now. Let's create that here. Yeah, we have created that. So let's well uh, import the form validation file here. validation.js so when we submit uh, we should we will call this uh, function so now let's get the value of the form uh, var name email is equal to document dot uh, the name of forum f1 dot email dot value uh, after getting the value so now let's perform operation on this first we will write a regular expression for the uh, email uh, this is the uh, regular expression that uh, this means that without space and at okay uh, this mean without space all character and at without this this sign means not okay without space and at sign include all character and then this plus mean uh, one or more character of this okay that we have specified uh, again then we should have at sign for example use of at gmail.com okay at then we should have at after name, um, then we should have a domain like a, for example, Google or Yahoo, uh, Gmail, Yahoo.com, okay? So for that, uh, are your domain name? Uh, so for that, we have this, okay, without space and uh, at sign, again, we have all the character, this means one or more, then we have a dot sign, okay, slash dot, it means that we should have dot after that, again, space and at sign, without them, we have the characters, for example, dot com, dot org, dot blah, blah. Uh, this uh, you can make it okay however you would like so just watch a video for regular expression so you can make that just uh, here character or capital character or number or symbols you can handle manage that so now let's write the validation for that apple email was empty oh sorry so then we should print um, a validation error okay here we should print away in error here so for that let's come to the forum and just uh, under this let's write do and write here id email error here we will now assign text here first i will get that war email error is equal to document that query selector we will get by id email error so now email error that inner html is equal to email is required then change the color of that email error dot style dot color is equal to rate then we will return false Uh, else if if you there was a text if it was not uh, empty so then we will just use this condition we will now test this regular expression okay so let's write email for turn dot test oh, sorry it is test email it will test if the uh, this uh, regular expression match so it will tr return true so if it didn't match so it will return false so we will make that to true we will use this not sign if it was not uh, for example if it didn't match it will return true we will change it will return false so then we will change that to the true and then it will execute this block of code now we are writing again we will write same thing like this 
and we should just change email not matched okay else we should change this text to empty this should be empty now and finally return true let's come to the forum and return validation okay we have called our function okay so now let's come see let's refresh the page let's press submit button email is required so now let's write for example topper just like this submit email not matched and topper add to gmail for example submit not matched if i write dot com or dot om it will be submitted see the forum has submitted so it was all about forum validation email validation in javascript if you like this video please subscribe our youtube channel and like this video thanks for watching